Let's go Wolves, we in Rome, and it is fucking amazing. Hey baby? Yeah. First impression so far is like, it's literally breathtaking. We just got off the plane, all right? We were traveling all morning. Our flight was at 6.20, so we had to leave our house at 3.50. We only got three hours of sleep. Uh, so it was a little exhausting, all right? It was a little exhausting, but uh, as soon as we got off the fucking airport and we got here, like driving through Rome, guys, like buckle in. Okay, I said this for the other vlogs, buckle in, because this is gonna be a long one. There's gonna be a lot of footage. Just as an example, across the little walk path that's behind me of our hotel, this is what's here. Okay, but look at this guys, right across the street. So there's a lot, um, our check-in isn't until three, three o'clock, so we're gonna go find some food, we're gonna get some stuff, and then the adventures fucking begin. So, uh, first stop, our right, first stop after obviously lunch where we had our first Italian pizza, which we didn't show you guys because we were fucking starving and we smashed it. <laughs> right, we babe? did. We ate it very fast, but I had delicious wine. Yes. I will say that much. It was amazing, and the pizza was honestly really fucking good, which was cool. Yeah. Um, but the first stop after that is to get a haircut. So I'm trying to clean up this fucking mop face, everything that I got going on here. Um, and then we're gonna try to book Julia a nail appointment because she wants to get her nails done as well. Um, so we look bougie for traveling around, around Italy. So when you see me next, okay, I'm gonna look absolutely fucking gorgeous. Okay, it's gonna literally like, oh God. Literally Aries the God of War, okay? You ready for it? So like, we're gonna look at the sky and boom. God of War fucking achieved. He absolutely slayed it. I love it, babe. What do you think? You look so handsome. You like it? Yeah. Did you do a good job? Yes. So, babe is my eyes because I don't usually wear my contacts Every time in the barbershop. It's like, how does it look? How does it look? I can't see anything. Is it good? <laughs> it's like I call my mom up. Come on, can you come look at my hair? Can you come look at my hair? But it was good. Uh, and now let's go see the hotel. Y'all ain't gonna believe this. This suite is crazy. Okay? Let's go into the B roll in three, two, one. So guys, turns out that there's a dope rooftop patio that you can have drinks and food on that overlooks a bunch of the fucking uh, the area. So we're gonna go check it out right now. I'm excited. It looks it, really it cool. It looks <laughs> super cool in yeah. the photos. So like this should be dope. All right, you guys are gonna get the first hand experience. Same with us. Oh yeah. Look at that, eh? This is beautiful. Okay, so there was a little bit of a change in plans. Me and my beautiful wifey, all right? Hello are currently on our way to Vatican City. We were gonna go see the Colosseum today, um, but some tickets and all whatever the fuck else. Okay, we had to do a different, a little bit of different planning. So we are currently going to Vatican City right now, and this walk is fucking dope. They got like a little walkway right beside the river in the middle of the city. Just looks dope. So we're gonna go explore Vatican City and like kind of see like the architecture built in Rome right now. Fucking lit. Hi. Hello. Okay guys, today is the day that we go and see the Coliseum. I'm super fucking excited. Are you excited, boo? I'm really excited. It should be so cool. Yes. Um, but before we do, before we embark on our adventure through the fucking beautiful Rome and see like all these crazy fucking different things, which you guys are going to see B-roll of and a bunch of other footage, um, I wanted to talk about Vatican City for a second because we almost didn't go in. 
All right, we almost didn't go in yesterday. I know it's a fucking like a theme with us. It's because when I get anxious and when I get hungry, I'm done. Like yeah. I just won't do shit. I'm like, oh, I'm good. I'm done. He sees the lineup and he's like, I don't think I like I, I don't have the patience for this. Yeah. <laughs> so we almost didn't fucking go in. Um, but we we sat down, we relaxed a couple of minutes. We we're like, fuck it, we're here. Let's just get in line and let's do it. The line was super quick. Mm-hmm. Um, and we I honestly saw a fucking lot. There was a yeah, lot that we ended it was up seeing. So cool. It was what is it called? Saint Peter's Church. Yes. It is the biggest Christian church in the world, right? Yes. You guys are going to see that there was actually a couple places we couldn't film. And it was like us going underneath the fucking church and walking through the tombs. Yeah. Of all the popes. Yeah. They have everybody buried under there. (laughs) Fucking crazy. Literally insane. And then there was on the other side of it, there's a museum, right? Where again, you couldn't film. You had to pay an extra five euro to get in. Yeah. Um, but you saw like crazy crazy shit crazy artifacts Mm -hmm. like super super cool stuff and like all this cool jewelry there was a ring guys that was this fucking big this huge yeah it was like i'm like how do you even like where you'd have to like i don't even know i don't even know it was so thick claw your hands together just to hold it on there it was crazy yeah it was fucking intense um so we didn't get to show you guys that stuff, but there's a lot of fucking footage that I want you guys to check out. It's gonna be lit. All right, hopefully you guys enjoyed. All right, going through everything yesterday, and now it's all about the Coliseum. So let's get it pop. <laughs> Okay, so um, they wouldn't let me film in the Coliseum with my big camera. Uh, right away, we were walking in and like we're walking up to the front desk. You guys kind of saw it. I was like kind of showing the top side. You might have saw like the front like check-in desk spot. But as soon as my camera hit that, homie walked like beelined it straight towards me. He's like, delete that right now. And he's like, keep saying it, keep saying it. So it's like leaning over my camera and he got like super fucking intense. Right, babe? He was intense. He's like, if you were in Spain or somewhere, somewhere else, and he's like, <laughs> yeah, he like legit, he was gonna, he said he was going to kill me. He's like, if you were there, and I'm like, what? And then he's like, delete it. I'm like, I did delete it's it. It's against the law. Yeah. It's like forbidden. It's forbidden. That's what he was saying. And he like forbidden, over forbidden. and over and over like, and okay, over again. Okay, delete it. Okay, got it. He's like, kept pushing it. it consistently, really consistently. So I didn't get to film in the Coliseum with my big camera, but homie didn't check my phone. So check this shit out. So, we're back. The Coliseum was fucking lit. It was so cool. So fucking cool. So, um, obviously that guy told me I couldn't film with the big camera, but fuck you, buddy. We did it anyways with the phone. Honestly, so lit. We still got so much footage. We didn't get to see everything. Like, there was, uh, like, underneath tunnels that we could have went through, and I thought that we were actually going to be able to, like, go down there no matter what. But regardless, we saw so fucking much. And yeah, it was so it was cool. So cool. Again, the architecture in fucking Rome blows my mind. It doesn't even make sense to me. And one cool thing that I did figure out, um, I think it was from the Vatican yesterday, um, is that a lot of the statues are actually made out of clay. And mm. we noticed that, like, if you guys pay attention to all the ruins here, like Julia pointed it out, there was like a toe missing. And then when you look at it, there's like pegs, like little pieces of like metal. Like little rebar and stuff. Some of them have like grass in there or something, mm-hmm. like straw basically. It was super cool though. So the Coliseum was absolutely amazing. Yeah. Like the biggest thing I've ever seen in my entire fucking life. So cool walking through it. You got to go like on the upper level, on the mid level, walk around. We had like the orange pass, which is like the second level up of like what you can do. Mm-hmm. Um, so we got to see everything other than obviously the tunnels the underneath. tunnels underground, yeah. Bought shoes too because we found a shoe store and I'm addicted. So we got some. Julia got some cool ones too, which I'm excited about. Let's check them out. So I got this pair. Like a little pair of like Nike running shoes. I'm just gonna probably wear them for walking. They're fucking lit. Julia got this pair of Nikes right here. Hell yeah. She's, so comfy. she's gonna look great in these. And then I got this pair of Adidas. Again, a little bit different. Not used to wearing this style, but I wanted to wear something that was uh, fucking unique. Look at these fucking shoes. These are lit. My boo. 
her little street vibe she's got going on. I like it. The hat does look good, but what you're wearing without the hat looks amazing too. Thank you. You're welcome. This is yours. That's my flannel. <laughs> but look at her new shoes. She's rocking them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There we go. Adventure time. Hey. Eh? Hola. Hola. This is cool. Super, super freaking cool. Where are we right now? I have no idea. What do you mean? <laughs> What's the say on the map? Um, hang on. I scoped these places out, but I didn't know what they're called. Okay, so we are exploring. The Pantheon. The Pantheon? Pantheon. How do you spell it? P-A-N-T-H-E-O-N. Pantheon. <laughs> Pantheon. <laughs> so we're exploring right now, and we're just seeing the crazy stuff around us. Guys, this is no joke, like a block and away from where our place is. Um, and it is fucking insane, as you guys can see. So dope. Where are we at, boo? <laughs> the font. Uh, the fountain, is that what you said? Fontana de Trevi. The Fontana de Trevi, okay? Yes. Guys, this place is insane, and I'm gonna show you right now. Look at this shit. This is super cool. Yes. Huh? <laughs> this is super cool. Julia told me that we were going to a fountain, but I didn't realize it was like the biggest fucking fountain I've like, ever seen whatever. in my life. We have a fountain in front of our hotel. Yeah, I'm like, and ours is dope. I'm like, it's got like <laughs> massive statues and it's coming out everywhere. This is insane. Yeah. Like literally, I think it's a statue of Zeus or some shit. Not Zeus, Poseidon. Maybe. I think so. This is what I'm talking about when it comes down to good architecture. I used to be an iron worker, okay? The buildings we build in Canada are trash. Legit trash. This is amazing. So right now, we're mapsing because we're going to take you to another dope spot. But we're also going to go to a camera store because I might be getting some new gear to make the vlog even better. So I pull it up on my map and we found a new feature that looks hilarious. So look at this shit. So literally, as you guys can see, you the big ass arrows. It, you, it uses the front facing camera and tells you where to go. Look at that. It tells you where to go. We're never getting lost again. <laughs> it's so cool. We're good, all right? Time for an adventure. So unfortunately, um, the camera store that we were going to did not have the camera stuff that I wanted. Um, so we're gonna have to wait off on that. But So we stopped to get a little bit of coffee and there's this little mural on the wall that is mad ironic, okay? There's all these vegetables and fruits. And the one with the carrots has glasses. Carrots are supposed to help with your eyesight, okay? I know because when I was younger, I thought if I ate a bunch of carrots, I wouldn't be blind in my left eye that much anymore. Um, did you know that? Did I tell you that story before? Yeah, I used to eat carrots like crazy because I thought it helped my eyesight. I didn't. It's ridiculous. That's ironic as fuck, I'm saying. So we are at the Spanish Steps. Apparently it's completely different in Italian, but that's the thing you guys just saw. It's like, Scalin, Scalinata della Trinita del Monte. Yes. There's no fucking way. Literally no way in hell that it's said like that. Now, if you're Italian and you watch this and you hate me, I apologize. But this is beautiful, it's super cool. Like look at it from down here. Honestly looks amazing. It's so big. And then down here, like it still goes farther. There's still like the fountain and everything down here. This is a dope little square. Hey, beautiful. You look amazing. Sexy wife in there getting ready. Hi, boo. Hi. God damn. Okay. Y'all, I am a lucky ass man right now. Look at that fucking smoking hot lady. And then she's got to date this fucking guy. I'm just kidding. I'm sexy too. Yeah. Right? Yeah. We are about to go to dinner. Um, it is going to be our last dinner in Rome. Uh, we're going to this real cute place. I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'm not even gonna fucking say it. Just gonna end this vlog with a little bit of B-roll of dinner. I uh, take it with my phone because I don't wanna bring my big camera. I appreciate y'all. Thank you guys so much for fucking watching. If you guys enjoyed another long ass travel vlog, okay? Um, and you wanna see more of this type of shit, Drop a comment below, like the fucking video, make sure you fucking subscribe, and stay tuned for the next one because tomorrow, me and my fucking baby girl go where, boo? Florence! We go to Florence. I'm so excited. It's gonna be fucking lit. And there's a couple things that uh, we might be doing in Florence that are gonna blow your guys' fucking minds. Okay, it looks amazing. Stay tuned. I'm out. Peace. What happened, boo? I got too handsy and I spilled my wine everywhere. <laughs> <laughs>
Thank you. Thank you. Look at this shit. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> All over me. It's not that bad. That's a party foul. <laughs>